Welcome back to the Financial Forecaster. Guys, today we have an exciting episode because today we're talking about the well health earnings that just came out. The Berkshire Hathaway of telehealth and medical holdings in Canada and I am very excited mostly because it's a very down day in the market and I needed a piece of good news and you know what the earnings from well health technologies definitely put me in a good mood so if you're ready please smash that like and subscribe we're about to break 600 subscribers welcome back to the channel financial forecaster guys let's go over some amazing earnings from well health technologies let's go All right, so the Well Health Technologies earnings report comes in. And if you don't know what Well Health Technologies is, it's a company in Canada that buys up telehealth companies, that buys up medical clinics, uh, both online and physical. And it is a company that has been trying to grow and grow by buying businesses, bringing them in, making them better, making them more efficient. And that's how they're, they're, they want to be a monster company. The CEO himself has said they want to be like a Berkshire Hathaway type model. Now, I don't know if that's completely apt, but you know what? That sounds like a very ambitious, but doable thing. So I want to tell you why it's so important for this earnings report. They grew 150% year over year in revenue and brought in 25.6 million this year. That's fantastic. This is a growth stock of epic proportions. I am telling you, if you are not watching Well Health or are in their stock, or like I have been in Well Health about over almost a year now, I think a little under a year, it is the best run company by far. Shorts come after it, couldn't tell, take it down. Wall Street Bets is even looking at it because the due diligence on this company is so matter of fact that it's, it's bananas. CRH Medical, the company they acquired in the States that's going to expand their footprint there, just acquired another company. This is so what Wall Health does. They just want to be the umbrella parent. They want to buy these companies that are already have great margins, make those margins better, and then make acquisitions themselves. That is incredible. The margins, the growth, the sector has barely been touched by any big company. That's why it's ripe for disruption. Nobody's even coming in and trying to challenge them. There's no big boys trying to challenge them, especially not in Canada. In the States, you have Teladoc. And, you know, that is the all-time favorite for so many people in the States. But not here in Canada. Today in Canada, we have Well Health. So this earnings report, let's get into it a little further. Let me get the stats. Now this is kind of a gotcha video because I'm not going to go over each and every number because I want you guys, if you're interested in investing in well health technologies or you have invested in well technologies to read the report yourself. Okay. This is a YouTube channel by some random guy, which almost every YouTube channel that you're going to are going to be. It's up to you to become the holder of your future and your financial freedom by looking at what you're investing in. So I'm gonna tell you that they grew 150% year over year in revenue, and I'm gonna tell you that the revenue figures were $25.6 million. Their second quarter adjusted EBITDA positive, and that is fantastic. The rest of the information, I need you guys to go out and read. I'm serious, go read the report. What are you doing with your money if you're not reading it? Because that is how we're learning. You're not learning by watching me on YouTube. You're not learning by watching other people on YouTube. You, you can learn a lot of things, but you're not investing the way you should be. So what's in for the future of well health? Well, they got money on the balance sheet. They've got ambition. They have an appetite for more countries, for expansion, and for making the companies they already do, already own, have better margins. If you can find a company that's like that, leave it down in the comments. I'll look through it. I'll compare it to well health. I don't have a better, this market is tumultuous right now. And one of my highest convictions, I have closed three positions now and put them into well. Now don't worry, I'm still sufficiently diversified. Those three positions were either swing trades that I didn't want to do anymore, uh, they were very short term, or they were something I just got on a whim, you know, just, just you want to make sure that your portfolio in these soft market times is in the stocks you have conviction in. That's it. If you have, you, you play, you can play any stock really in a really strong market coming out of the March lows last year, you could put the, pretty much put it into anything, but going into weakness, you want to make sure that it's in something strong, something, you know, and something you can play and keep it within so you can sleep. 
You want to be able to sleep at night and not worry your stock's going to be down 20, 30% in the morning. That will kill you every time. So Well Health Technologies, go read the report. I don't have to remind you again. I'll leave it down below. Please comment if you, if you uh, were upset that I didn't give you any numbers, give it to me. Let me have it. But you know what? I wanted to do this kind of video and this is my YouTube channel. So I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you can hear the passion in my voice for this company. And I hope you have a great day. Hit that like and subscribe. Have a good one. Let's get rich together. Financial Forecaster out.